Hallo zusammen zurück bei Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishments. Wir werden jetzt diesen, äh, dieses Versteckspiel mal nachstellen. Wiggins, my lad, what are you doing here? You'd best be leaving and be quick about it. I've done nothing wrong. You'd learn more by watching Mr. Holmes. He knows exactly what he's doing. Not like you. Oi, watch your tongue. Constable Marrow, Watson, I would like to perform another kind of reenactment with your help. I'm listening, Mr. Holmes. I want to check if Leighton's testimony can be trusted. If someone could vanish into thin air at a specific moment. But Holmes, I don't see how. I am going to be the mysterious gentleman whom Leighton followed. I will stand exactly where he saw him before he was blinded by the flash. Watson. You will be Leighton. When I fire the signal flare, you should start to chase me. I understand, Holmes. You, Constable Marrow, just play your part and do exactly as you did. Just, please, wait five seconds after the signal flare. I doubt that Polly Powell would have screamed any earlier. As you say, Mr. Holmes. Let us begin, then. Catch me if you can. <laughs> This wall is cast in shadow. It would be difficult to see anyone scaling it. I can barely see anything. Holmes, are you there? <laughs> Holmes is concentrated, must klettern. I should try climbing faster. See anything. Holmes? Are you there? <laughs> Na, wie lange müssen wir das Spiel noch spielen? Ja. Where is he? My God, a man can't just disappear like that. <laughs> Holmes? Holmes? Where are you? I cannot see you, Mr. Holmes. Dr. Watson, it seems that Mr. Holmes has disappeared. Don't worry, gentlemen. I am up here, above your heads. How on earth did you get up there, Holmes? I am using crampons and a climbing axe, although the person we are looking for did not leave any traces of such tools. Constable, is there any way to get to the top of this building? Yes, Mr. Holmes, I can show you. The door to the building can be found from Whitechapel Street. Gentlemen, I am on my way down. <laughs> okay, so das soll jetzt die Tür sein hier. Dann gucken wir uns mal hier um. These shards of glass are from the window above. It's empty. A cluster of thick black threads. They're unusually strong. I should examine them under the microscope. Someone broke through the window to get inside the attic, but in his haste, he ripped his jacket. 
we can conclude that the person whom Leighton saw climbed up the wall, broke into the attic window, and escaped through the hatch. Haben wir auf jeden Fall die dritte Person. War also kein Fantasiemann. Leighton ist unschuldig. Oder erdrückende Beweislast. Ich sagte, er ist unschuldig. Auch wenn das irgendwie alles noch nicht so passt, wie es soll. Hier jetzt fertig auf dem Dachboden. Scheint so. Dann gehen wir mal erstmal in die Baker Street. gucken uns mal im Mikroskop oder unter dem Mikroskop an, was das ist. Let us take a closer look. It is not a thread, but a hair. I very much doubt that it is human. I need to compare this sample with a human hair and a horse hair. Hmm. A shaving brush is usually made from horsehair. Watson, uh, could you please pass me your shaving brush? Here you are. Uh, Watson, look, what's outside the window? Well, I don't see anything. Ouch! Holmes! <laughs> oh, don't make such a fuss. One little hair. Human hair is significantly thinner than the black sample. The horse hair is thinner than the hair that we found. So, this black hair belongs to an animal, and it is larger than a horse. A hair from a large and exotic animal. So, was jetzt? Zirkus Akrobat. Ja gut, Fantasie man auf keinen Fall. Haha, schaut mal hier. In Luft aufgelöst. Der Mann, der, den nur Leighton Chapman gesehen hat, konnte fliehen, indem er eine Wand hochkletterte. Ein fähiger Akrobat. Offensichtlich, er nahm zuvor die Waffe von einer der Leichen an sich. Wiggins hat bei der Zirkussuche um Hilfe. Äh, Wiggins bitten um. Okay. Wiggins is currently at Half Moon Street. Wie er denn ab dahin? Warum gibt es denn überhaupt die Möglichkeit zum Fenster zu gehen und ihn zu rufen? So, jetzt wird er bestimmt gleich wieder belagert. Look here, lad. Yeah. You'd better go home and start thinking about what a fine pickle your brother's landed himself in. Ha! But he'll be free tonight, because he's innocent. Don't be daft, lad. It's a closed case. Mr. Holmes? We have good news for you, Wiggins. The investigation has proven very interesting so far. We found facts and details that confirm your brother's innocence. I knew it, Mr. Holmes. But for now, Wiggins, we need your help. Anything you like, Gov. I need you to locate a circus that has stopped over in London. It needs to have disposed of at least one exotic animal, a very large one. You can count on me, Mr. Holmes. Na, dann fahren wir wohl automatisch gleich dahin.
I do hope that the children don't get into trouble, Holmes. Don't worry, Watson. I predict some news in seven seconds. Mr. Holmes, we found it. Here it is. <laughs> and this is a young Indian elephant, the highlight of the show. Duval Brothers, a well-known traveling circus that is currently stopped in London. I believe that is exactly the type of circus we are looking for. I'll pay it a visit. Nadan gehen wir mal in den Zirkus. Die anderen Orte sind doch irgendwie alle gerade gelöscht worden. Hi, you. Stop right there. Good morning, sir. Pardon me, but why am I not allowed to walk around here? Because it's private. Well, I only wanted to meet the artists. Hmm? You're wanting to apply for... Nah. You don't look like the type of uh, artistic lock picker that we're looking for. You might be surprised. What? Nah. I don't think so. Clear off. You're a bit slow to catch on, eh? Get lost. Warum? Scheiße, lass mich You're a bit durch. slow to catch on, eh? Get lost. Wie komme ich denn da rein? Vielleicht muss ich mich umziehen. Verkleiden. So, was wählen wir denn hier? Freizeitanzug? Nee, dunkler Anzug. Nee, braun, nee, grün, grau, hell. Bandit. Ja. Bauern, Morgenmantel. Seemann. Seemann hatten wir schon. Aufgeknöpft. Freizeitanzug. Jetzt nehmen wir hier den Bandit. Jetzt schmücken wir uns noch. Kopfbedeckung. Hier nehmen wir mal hier diese die Schiebermütze. Noch ein Bart. Mal noch eine Brille. Nehmen wir mal so, sieht ja richtig schön runter, er kommt aus. Jedenfalls kein gepflegter Bart. Stay where you are. What are you doing here and where is Sherlock Holmes? Calm down, Watson. Take deep breaths now. It's me. Oh, thank God, Holmes. I can't get used to your disguises. Thank you, Watson. That means I am ready to go. <lacht> Gut, probieren wir es nochmal. Who are you? What's your name? My name is Nigel. I'm here to open the locks. Talented, eh? Let's see. Go inside the marquee and show yourself to Charles Foley. 
And I'd highly advise you not to trick him. Got that? I've got it. Guck mal, ob wir hier noch irgendwas vorher entdecken können. Wo ist denn hier? Okay, dürfen wir erstmal nicht. Na dann, ab da rein. Everything is here, just as you asked. And what about the money? Some of the barrels are wet. Transportation issues, it couldn't be helped. Whatever. We'll be here after midnight to pick up the supplies. I want to be paid first. No. You'll be paid after we make the transfer, as I said. Right? I hope that no one saw you. The police are on the lookout. Of course not. I'm a professional. Glad to hear it. Be ready for tonight, then. Hm. Interessant, interessant. This wooden barrel is damaged. It is difficult to say what is inside. This wooden Ach barrel so. is damaged. It is difficult to say what is inside. There is a spot on this barrel that was intentionally painted out. Hey, the crest of the Honorable Artillery Company. Could it be gunpowder? I need to be sure. <laughs> hmm. Judging by the fractions and the scent, I can confirm that it is, in fact, gunpowder. The barrels are roughly clustered. It seems as though they were brought here in a hurry. Nick, immer dran vorbei hier. Da. Kann man die Handel hochheben oder auf dem Einrad fahren, Holmes? <laughs> This printing press is old, but still quite capable of printing hundreds of pages per day. Rise up and keep rising from lambs into lions. From lambs into lions. Those are words of encouragement and defiance. That's a picture of a contemporary gentleman wearing a Robin Hood hat. Interesting. This poster was clearly made to fire up rebellion amongst the people. Hmm. There are enough posters to paste across half of London's walls. Powder kegs, a printing press, and a great many blank papers. All of this was stolen by the Merry Men quite recently. And these poster samples. I am quite sure it is not a coincidence. The Merry Men are planning some sort of sabotage. Stop right here. Who are you? Are you Charles Foley? Maybe. They say that I can open any door. Do they now? We'll see that lock near the chains on the table over there. Open that. Yes, Mondo, who are these my points in? Der ja noch gefehlt. Ah, schau mal hier. Da wurde einer angeschossen.
Man im Jackett hat Foley trägt einen antiken Ring, das letzte fehlende Stück, sowie ein Revolver unter seinem Gürtel. Das beweist, dass Foley der geheimnisvolle Mann im Jackett war, der so geschickt aus der Hafen Street fliehen konnte. hin. Muss ich jetzt dieses doofe Schloss hier knacken? Das habe ich bei den letzten Schlössern irgendwie komplett vergeigt mit diesen äh, Dingern. So. Ich habe das Schloss geknackt, Mister. Ah. Well, hey, right. What's your name? Nigel Shirley from York. Ah. Nigel from York. Never heard anything about you. How'd you hear about me? Ähm. Um. Nee, falsch, verdammt. Ah, Nigel from York. Never heard anything about you. How'd you hear about me? Nee, ah, falsch, da wollte ich doch gar nicht drauf. Ma. Ah, Nigel from York. Never heard anything about you. Die Anfragen you waren jetzt einmal sortiert. Ja, auch nicht. Denn die Insassen vielleicht. Ah, Nigel from York. Never heard anything about you. How'd you hear about me? Dann haben wir die Insassen jetzt hier. Auch nicht. Der Türschlüssel? Der verhaftete Dieb? Hä? Ah, Nigel from York. Never heard anything about you. How'd you hear about me? Okay, der verhaftete It's a long Dieb. story. I met your brother. Vincent the Butcher Foley, in prison. He told me all about his betrayal, and all about you. Before I was released, he told me that you might find a job for me one day, and pay me some money for me craft. Well, he died. Seven days ago, in prison. Hmm. I'm sorry to hear that. That's all right. The traitor has paid the blood price for it. And you'll do the job anyway, because I need a talented look picker. I know just where to search for his legacy. It's all about the Hellenistic treasures, isn't it? Osh, you fool. Now, listen up. You'll come with us tonight, and you better mind yourself. Us? Wait, who's coming then? Billy, Jack and me. And what will I get for that? We'll share the loot. The one you seem to know about. Right. Wait for us at the abandoned manor house on the corner of Ledbrook Grove and Kensington Park Road at midnight. Deal. Na dann mal ab dahin. Here I am at the manor. Somewhere inside it are the Hellenistic treasures. Aber Leute, 
das schauen wir uns beim nächsten Mal an. Für heute war es das. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen. Bis bald. Tschüssi.